Okay, hello and welcome back to Versus Umbra. So today we're going to finish up um, after we upgraded all our weapons last time. So yes, um, let's begin. And I'm going to go to uh, here, load game. And okay, let's make sure we have everything upgraded to version 10. Yep, level 10, everything is good. So. Now we can begin. We can go through all the plans. So, let's see. I'm going to... Oh, we've already done this, but let's do the next one. All the challenges are completed, as we know. Alright. Um, before we begin, let me just see what else we can unlock. The uh, extra achievements. Let's see. Looks like everything except complete campaign in Paradox mode. Complete campaign on hard difficulty in Paradox mode. So those are key things we are going to do, actually. So, yes. So, yeah, just making sure, and okay, we are ready to go. I'll stay behind and provide you more encouraging words over the radio. What about new armor and stuff? I'm sure no problem will somehow solve itself if we just ignore that. Okay. So, before we begin, let's make sure everything we need is equipped. Yep. Alright. And let's continue. This is going to be easy. This weapon is quite overpowered. Alright. Next level. Forest fire. Doesn't that of course seem familiar? No, it does not. It's all totally new. Okay. Can't read that. <laughs> what language is it? I don't, I don't know. I'm just going to say we said okay in overly complicated foreign language. Oh, of course, she has infinitely deep pockets. Uh, okay. Alright, and we level up again. Let's see. And uh, we can get, uh, I guess this. Alright. Okay. Okay, without a parachute, he just got on the I'm sure he has an extra parachute or something. Anyways. Okay. Full we'll stop. Reinforcements are here. Where are the other soldiers, assassins, mercenaries? No one but you have showed up. Oh well, the invaders doesn't seem my pop day, anyways. But most of them are stuck in a traffic jam, jam so they'll probably arrive somewhat randomly in one at a time. Oh dear. Eh? Alright, what's so. up? Anyways... Soldiers, not full intergalactic peace. 
Weapon. And that giant laser does eat their dragon pretty fast, I suppose. But anyways, alright, feral fuel. Be careful out there, it used to be explosive feral facility. Oh dear. Why would anyone need a facility that only produces feral fuels? Filled with high explosive material. I've been told that there is this one guy who orders them in bundles of hundreds of thousands. I guess there is a market for everything these days. Alright, so we can be careful with the oil barrels. Okay. Okay. Alright. 
Oh, we don't have to before because the challenge is already been completed. I still like to, it's fine. So, yeah. Look at the damage you're doing. So much damage. I still have a lot of ammo. Alright. Wow. This keeps going. Alright, level up. Let's see. Butterfingers. Oh, we got it. Alright. Nice. Alright. And level 10. And finish the level. Huh. Looks like we still could have been good for a while. Even, uh, without this puppy, perhaps? I don't know. I think if you are up and through instead, it's still a spell that's trying to open my so... I don't know. That's something I'm wondering about. Huh. And we made it. Alright. Return to base. Okay, straight. Here we go. And, um... Yes, yeah, so in this planet... The reason we leveled up everything again, um, is because of that one level where it picks random weapons for you to use. Regardless of if you decide to do the extra quest or not, it'll happen anyway, so, yeah. Okay, but that's not there yet. We're gonna get there eventually. Um, anyways. This doesn't look like modern. It's not. It's, uh, sign you up for the Ion Fist Tournament on Stradium. I hand out good prizes and we'll need them if you want to survive a possible final encounter. You sometimes feel like the person who has to risk it for Yeah, I'm sure people could relate to that. Alright, let's see. Alright, let's see. Extra health ability, uh, helps you, like, it's kind of like, I don't know, killing potions that you can, like, um, regenerate and use whenever you need to. Okay. Anyways, um, I guess we'll get this almost there. Alright. Survival round. Did you see me? I totally won. I'm, uh, I don't know what that is. Funny, this show is done. Isn't that one of those terrible sitcoms with a laugh track? Hey, the laugh track is an awesome feature. Yeah, again, I don't know what show this is, but, uh, okay. Um, well, I'll have to look at it later. Sorry again if I don't really get all the references, but, anyways. Maybe it's just an old show or something that I don't know about. I, I, it could be that. Uh, there's another one where they can lose their weapons. I don't know if I got there yet, but 
So the other one where it makes them lose their weapons, they will switch to melee instead of range, I think. Um, so yeah, one where I lose to armor, that just um, makes them not really have any armor, basically. And it makes them easier to, to kill, basically. So yeah. Okay. I guess before I just wanted to get all the uh, critical hit chance and damage potential beforehand instead of the um. Another, another thing. But anyways, um. All right, here we go. This is the random weapon round. The dreaded level I keep talking about. <laughs> What kind of tournament is this? All participants are getting up on it. I've been told that it's pretty popular with the tournaments these days. Alright, so we have this weapon. We're just gonna use it now. It's a good one. And we are going to switch our weapons soon. Alright. And thankfully we have to free everything. Let's just try to survive.
Anyways, um, anyways, um, yeah, so the dialogue is kind of long. Um, I don't know what I'm doing, but anyways, why would you land so far from our objective? Service land to come. Oh my gosh. Alright, anyways. So, this is the last plan, so we do need to keep the mind to try to not take too much damage and endure it. Which we should be able to do. Alright. He knows all our competition goes like this. One of them has a reasonable question, the other one responds to something goofy. Yes! I, uh, I know what that is talking about. Well, my face really isn't broken. Okay! <clears throat> Yeah, I don't know, I think the person's humor is broken or something. That's just probably what it's referring to. Honestly, I think everyone's humor is just different. Okay, we have no other parts to pick. We're just gonna keep leveling up, I guess. Okay. Yeah, I think what someone finds funny, someone else might not find funny. It depends on the person. I think that's something I would like Say. Well, let me be honest, some of the jokes I think I might like actually. I forgot what it was, but yes. Anyways. <laughs> I think we should call all the references though. I don't, I don't think I got all the references. <laughs> I do feel like we need this planet after, um, the inspired by Madness Combat, perhaps? I don't know, I am just guessing that. So it sounds like, you know, Nevada or something. I just, I keep saying that, like, because I just, I feel like that's what it actually is called. I don't know why. Why exactly would you jump off a cliff without a parachute? Didn't we already do this thing? Maybe, but it doesn't change the fact that the boat's your license should be turned into, um, non-explosive bifurcation grenades. Okay, okay, well. Yeah, if you're jumping off a plane, you need a parachute. That's just, uh, yeah. Something you might want to keep in mind. Okay, so we are still leveling up, oddly enough. Um, so we don't need to. Um, okay. Okay. 
Okay. 